Sarah Grace back with you and I'm so excited because I'm starting a new series over here, um, kind of just my entrepreneur life because if you've been following me on Instagram at Freshman Healthy or my personal one, Sarah Grace Span, you know I'm picking the unsafe route. I'm going out of my comfort zone. I'm not following necessarily the typical sport RD path and I am opening up my own business with my consulting services online and then also building a program from the ground up at a training facility in Tallahassee. So with that being said, I have been reading so much. I've been listening to so many entrepreneurs out there, but when push comes to shove, there's no one out there sharing their journey from the ground up. You know, I, I listen to all of these entrepreneurs that are already successful and that's awesome and they are very inspiring and have so much knowledge to share. But I want someone that, you know, I can relate with more that, you know, is right where I'm at right now that hasn't experienced success yet. And so that's what I'm hoping to be for someone else out there. So I'm gonna start this new whole entrepreneur life series and just playlist. And anyone that is interested in it can subscribe to it. I know it's a little different than my health and fitness necessarily stuff. But even if you're not wanting to go necessarily the entrepreneur route, I think this can be really helpful just in life. So basically this playlist and series is just gonna be that. It's just my life and my journey of entrepreneurship from the ground up of I am not successful yet, I don't know what I'm doing, and I am scared out of my mind. But I'm doing it because I know that that's what I'm called to and that's what I'm passionate about and I am not settling for anything less. And so come with me for this journey if you want. Every single week I'm gonna be sharing videos on this playlist of just things I'm learning, things I'm trying myself in my own business and in my own life of entrepreneurship. And I'm gonna just be sharing with you guys the successes and the failures, all of it. And I hope you guys enjoy it and can learn something from it. So anyways, that is that. And let's get to the first video and topic of this series. And that is drowning out the noises. So I haven't even started yet. I'm traveling the month of May and then I'm gonna sit and study for my RD exam and take that RD exam in June. So I'm not even starting necessarily on the big ideas, the vision and the path of entrepreneurship yet, necessarily speaking. I mean, yes, I'm doing small things here and there, but one thing I've already come across in my journey of entrepreneurship, even before getting started, is the fact that you cannot care what other people think of you. You cannot care what other people are saying. You cannot care if other people don't believe in you and believe in your goals. It's actually a good sign if people are doubting your goals because if they are thinking, oh yeah, you can definitely do that, you're probably setting your goals too small. If people are saying, oh, that sounds like a great idea, you can definitely accomplish that. It's probably too small of a goal, guys. We need to be setting big goals where people are like, ah, I don't know about that. I don't think that's possible or that's setting the bar a little too high. Those are the kind of goals that we should be setting. But unfortunately, I've already come across the fact that we have to drown out those noises, even from people we love most. As I've, you know, had to think about it and think, okay, do I want to go the typical route and do I want to accept you know, work your way up the totem pole of sports RD and that's what you do and that's how it goes. And all of a sudden I realized that's not what I wanted to do. And it was scary because a lot of people were telling me you're being dumb. Like you need to, like some people were saying like you should be going this path. Others were saying you need to get a full-time job and stop being in la la land. Even my own family member, I won't even say who, but someone in my family, even texted me, waking me up at 6 a.m. one morning as I was trying to figure out where I wanted to go, what my life was gonna look like in the next coming months and year and everything. I got woken up by a text saying, you need to settle down, you need to go get a full-time job, and you need to stop living in this dreamland. And that hurt, guys. That hurt so badly because I'm sitting here thinking, I, I wish my family even supported me. Like, come on, at least my family, even if it's not other people, like I would expect my own family to support me and think that this is good for me and that, wow, you're following your dreams. Great job, Sarah Grace. But that's not the case. And I just am 
telling you guys in this video, you have to drown out the noise. You have to be your biggest cheerleader. You have to believe in yourself and you have to know that I can do it and no matter what other people say and no matter if people are thinking she's gonna fail, this isn't smart, this is stupid, you need to go with your gut, you need to go with your heart and you need to follow your passion and you need to drown out the noise. And so that is my little tip of the day today on this new series of entrepreneurship Drowning out the noises, not caring what other people think, and going with your gut and what you know you're called to do. So until next time, I hope you guys like this new series. If you do, comment below. And just any thoughts too. Follow me on Sarah Grace Span on Instagram for my life journey. And then Freshman and Healthy for health and fitness and food. <laughs> Till next time, guys. Bye.